Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, whatever time zone you're in. This is the Wix online meeting number 44, getting our way halfway into October, which of course means we're getting that much closer to a Wix 3.9 release. As always, these meetings are recorded for those people that aren't able to be here right now with us. So getting on with the agenda, we're going to do triage plus the WIP reviews. Uh, we decided we would add these just to kind of get people thinking about Wix 4. And after we do the triage and WIP reviews, we'll have a discussion about progress because who knows what will come out of triage and who knows what will come out of the reviews. Do that. And then, as always, we'll have questions, comments. And just a quick reminder to everybody that's here and the people that are watching later, you can always submit agenda items. So this list could grow. This is our kind of standing list as we finish up on Wix 3.9 kind of stuff. But if you have something you want to discuss, feel free to send it to me ahead of time, and we'll add it to the agenda and talk about it directly. On that note, Bob, you ready to go do triage? I am all set. All right, triage. Specify type of payload verification that occurred with log entries. They want to know whether they used a certificate or a file hash. Don't use certificates because they have all kinds of problems that we've been seeing. That's one solution. I, I'm actually surprised that it's not, it might not be in the exact message, but I'm, I'd be surprised if there aren't other different messages that get logged. Yeah, because probably only on failure, probably not on success. Uh, okay, yeah, I guess I can see that. Uh, we could toss it 3x, I don't really care. If he wanted to do it, that'd be cool, but I'm not really that excited about it. Thoughts? Anybody care? I guess it's mildly interesting. Barely. Barely. Well, especially as mostly we... because I agree. I think you know the the hash is going to be the way to go. So yeah, just won't matter much. So the question is, do we suspend it or not? Uh, I think it falls into that bucket of. If someone were to do it, it wouldn't be rejected harshly. Yeah. All right, so do you want to met into 30X? Yes. Okay, done. Good. Move variable conditions. So this is Sean's whip. I think we'll talk about this and that, although I do think we should take this in four, assuming Sean stills doing that, but yeah. Let's bring this in the 4 and he can move it to another release if he doesn't, or if he doesn't want to do it in 4. Sorry, you want to move it into 4.0? Yeah, sorry, it's in 4. Sorry. Uh, Let's it's open it. Already. It's already in 4.0. We'll right. open it. This is a good thing to do. We've had some discussions about it. Yep. The the remaining discussions are about how to go about implementing it, but that's all good. That's what the WIP is for. Right, right. Lux variously broken. I think I've already taken the fix for this in 3 and 4, right? Because uh, it was easy? I don't know. I, Maybe don't, not. Maybe I not. doubt it because I didn't do a fix oh. against four. Oh, all right. Cause... Then no, this has not happened before. I remember, uh, oh, I'm, I probably I'm looked at like three. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yep. Yeah. I opened the, the pull request. A couple of things. Disturbingly, that uh, at least part of it's been broken for quite a while. Um, yep. The custom action stuff, I don't know when got broken, but... So, anyway, I'm all, yeah, sounds good. 310, put it there. It's already got an owner. Carry on. Yep. Can do. Request that burn respect setting MSI log like it does MSI fast. Oh, yes, I remember the discussion. Yeah, it seems like we should be able to handle that such that if you've defined it near MSI or a property, that burn doesn't over, always overwrite it with its own setting. It's a little bit rude. Um, um is it? <laughs> well,. So MSI logging is the thing that specifies the the logging verbosity, right? Yes. Yeah, okay. So if for some reason that you knew you could get by with non robust logs, yeah, you could have a much smaller log file. I don't know how that works, but you know, whatever. Anyway. So I think opening this forex is a great thing. If someone wants to do it, it totally makes sense. I mean we already do this with things like MSI fast install. Sure, sure. It's just one of those things, it it's a great idea until it fails because you suddenly can't diagnose a problem because there's, you know, stupid logging instead of nice, verbose, useful logging. Uh, but yeah. that's fine. Yeah. 
Well, you could change it, send a new bundle out. Yeah. <laughs> and that will take that. And I, but taking it 4X is fine. I mean, if someone wants to do it, it's all good. So that will take care of that. Boom. Specified type of payload. Yeah, that'll go away. All right, cool. So moving on to the WIP review, we have these out here. I don't necessarily have anything I want to talk about in particular. I just kind of want to bring this up and see if people have things they want to poke at and things. Sean has, over the last couple of weeks, been wanting to make sure that his stuff was on the radar. I don't know if there's more we need to discuss about these beyond some discussions that have gone on in mail right now and stuff like that. So I'm mostly filling in as people look through this list, think about stuff they might want to talk about. Of course, getting stuff on this list um, and things like that. You know, so on and so forth. So, I I I figure we'll just add this to the standard set of things that we do each week, um, so people can see the list and go, oh, oh, right, right, right. I need to get on that. Or yeah, yeah. No, looks good. Still making the progress that it is. Um, I did not put my thing on this because it's mostly just a, I've been refactoring. If you've been watching the pull request go in the floor. I've been refactoring the binder in massive ways to make it easier to do things, which is, I guess, this right here. And now I'm in trying to clean up the MSI database thing so that I can then decide if I want to do a feature in there. But just trying to make the stuff much more solid and honestly, maybe a little faster. I, I'm seeing stuff that could maybe be perf improvements a little bit. Um, anyway. So there we go. That's the the whip review that we could be doing. That people have ideas and things like that. It'd be great to get that in there. Not a lot of discussion. So back on progress. It looks like we're still on track for three nine. I mean, we're not taking any bugs this week. Don't take any bugs in next week. And I think that'll be just about it, right? I don't see anything else. I mean, that's that's yeah. the next two Thursdays, and then you know we'll get around to next. Oh, sorry. How am I looking at December 2014? That's crazy. Let's go back to October, Rob. So, yeah, so we have next week, and then, oh, we do have Halloween Eve. Um, Hallow's Eve, is that what that is? Um, to uh, cover the last set of bugs. I guess we could find a ship stopper on the night before. The night before Halloween, they found a bug that ate the whole release. Um, but nothing like that. All right. And then 310 can start on November 1st. Uh, which, of course, means just doing a little bit of stuff that I'd probably do. Uh, maybe Friday evening I'll juggle it all around, and then we can start taking those pull requests for 3.10 into develop, and everybody will be locked and free to go run and fix all those 3.10 bugs that they've been thinking about fixing, even though you could fix them now and send pull requests. It's the same thing we said for the last few weeks. Just want to make sure everybody's on the same page. Everybody's out there going, yeah, yeah, we're all good. It's all good. No deltas? All right. Yeah, no, nothing's changed. Uh, 4 features. Uh, have, I know there's a little bit of a backlog on the pull request that a few people have sent. I do appreciate that. I've been really busy trying to get my binder stuff off of my machine, so I apologize for not getting through all those pull requests. I promise that I will as soon as I get past the last bulk of these binder changes. Um, truth be told, I'm being a little selfish because I don't want to take anybody else's pull requests against my ginormous things, and I'll do the merge and rebases for people if I need to to get their other stuff done. Um, but otherwise, if you have stuff you want to do in four, now would be a good time to start uh, doing that. Um, and for a timeline, I'm just going to leave that question mark on there for a while. We've had a few discussions about when four is done, and we'll have to see how it goes. So, anything you want to add, Bob? No, that sounds good. I mean, if you're volunteering to do all the, the Git stuff on... Uh Halloween night, instead of handing out candy, that's fine. Well, it'll be it'll be late, late, late. Oh, okay. I can do the gift stuff after we do the release, like you know. Yeah, well, we yeah, in the morning to. and stuff. We'll see. Yeah. Kind of depends how the day goes. Or maybe I'll just do it midnight on Halloween Eve. You know, after midnight on the thirtieth. So then, it, technically speaking, it's Halloween. It's just the earliest that it can be for me to be Halloween. So anyway, I'll, I'll be asleep. So. So we will we'll get all that straightened out. Honestly, most of that's just behind the scenes stuff, making the whole release right. It's not hopefully at all impactful on any of you guys that just contribute code and make things go and all that kind of stuff. So 
Um, also, I, I will take this opportunity to note that Wix 4 is becoming more and more unlike Wix 3, so keep that in mind as when you have features, things to fix, do them in Wix 4, and then we'll figure out if we can get them backported to Wix 3, but there are probably going to be more and more changes depending on the areas. Uh, more and more changes have to be done to make that fit into 3, um, all in the name of progress. Um, so, I think on that note, questions, comments, things people want to talk about? Anything else going on out there? Oh, some people type in stuff. That's good. Uh, yeah, Blair already mentioned about uh, doing pull requests both for 4x and for 3x, which is which is pretty much the way to think about it. So yeah. All right. Any other things people want to ask about, talk about things? Anything going on? John, DSC will just rot your brain. Oh. <laughs> All right. Well. Uh, bummer. This is, all right, well, we're not. All right, well, if there's nothing else going on out there, then we'll call it good, and uh, we'll pick it up here again next week, next week being the the one before Halloween. Oh, or I guess the last week that hopefully anything, really, we would take, we'll talk about things like that, hopefully mostly uneventful. I could jinx it and say, we're you know, there's just no way we're going to get a stop ship bug, but... <laughs> I don't know what happens when you say that you're going to jinx it, but you didn't. Uh, I, that, that's just too meta for me. Um, all righty then. Well, given that, I guess we're going to be done in about 15 minutes. That's not bad. That's kind of, I think, what we expected these meetings to get to when we didn't have a whole lot of stuff on the agenda. Right, Bob? About 15 minutes? Well, yeah, and especially if we have just a handful of bugs. Just a handful of bugs. Well, I mean, yeah. hopefully it stays that way. And yeah. straightforward <laughs> bugs and stuff like that. So, yeah. All right, well... I guess that's it. Until next week, uh, you guys have a wonderful time, and uh, we'll see you later. Bye. Bye.